Hey guys, Shaylee here with your weekly entertainment news. Fashion designer Manish Malhotra is turning to directing, ready to launch his production house, Stage 5, with three movies. One of the projects will be a biopic on veteran legend, late Mina Kumari. The Ace designer recently confirmed that he is indeed working on the biopic and that the script is currently underway. In an interview with film companion, Manish Malhotra said, I don't know how it got out. Come on now. But it is happening. We are still working on the script. The script is key always. I have been reading her books. The films is based on her books. I've always been fascinated by Mina Kumari. He revealed that Rekha inspired him to go ahead with the Mina Kumari project. He added, quote, Rekha told me once that you know when you turn 40, you will understand the genius of Mina Kumari. And that is true. Mina Kumari passed away at the age of 38 from liver cirrhosis. She had worked in 98 films and is considered one of the legendary stars of Indian cinema. Reportedly, Kriti Sanon has been signed to play Mina in the biopic. The hit Bollywood film Vida the Wedding is all set to return to the big screen with its much awaited sequel, Vida the Wedding 2. Released in 2018, the film was produced by Rhea Kapoor and Ekta Kapoor and featured an ensemble cast of Karina Kapoor Khan, Sonam Kapoor, Swara Bhaskar, and Shikha Talsanya in lead roles. Directed by Shashanka Ghosh, the comedy drama became a box office hit, grossing over RS 100 crore worldwide. According to a recent report by Pink Villa, the makers have finalized the idea and concept for the sequel, and Vita the Wedding 2 will commence filming next year. The news has sparked excitement amongst fans who eagerly awaited the return of the dynamic quartet. The first installment, Vita the Wedding, showcased the sisterhood amongst four friends as they navigated through the complexities of relationships, careers, and family. The film not only impressed the audience, but the box office performance also surprised its producers, Rhea and Ekta Kapoor, who hadn't anticipated such remarkable box office numbers. With Via the Wedding 2 on the horizon and fans eagerly awaiting more updates, the announcement of the cast for the much anticipated sequel. The film is undoubtedly gearing up to deliver another entertaining and empowering cinematic experience. Richa Chadda is all set to make her international debut. Her first international film, which is titled Aina, is set in the UK and Richa flew to London last week to commence shooting for it. It's an Indo-British project where Richa will be seen playing the lead character alongside Chronicles of Narnia fame, William Mosley. The movie is going to be a drama which is based on real life events. Having been eyeing an interesting project for quite some time, Richa, after reading many scripts finally zeroed in on this project. The film, after its London schedule, will be shot in different locations in India. Richa said, quote, I had a couple of scripts for international projects but nothing was fitting well. When Aina came away, I knew this was the one and now it is finally happening. I'm extremely thrilled. The film has a very interesting storyline. The actress wrapped her, her shoot for Fukre 3, where she continues playing the role of Bholi Punjaban. She also finished her other work commitment regarding the Maiden project from her production house, Girls Will Be Girls, which stars Malayalam cinema actor Gani Kusruti in the lead role.